Hello, my name is Navigator, and in this quick video I wanted to go over uh, what I would like to call some punk pickups, that being some CM Punk action figure pickups, and I figured now, I mean quite literally, would be the best time to uh, film this and I'll probably upload this tomorrow, but not even a minute ago I got done watching the whole uh, CM Punk, Seth Rollins, Drew McIntyre encounter on Raw, and that was pretty sweet. It seems like uh, CM Punk is most likely going to be the guest referee, and if not, then on commentary. But regardless, in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at two recent CM Punk pickups that I, well, picked up. This one right here, uh, I should have a video going up alongside this talking about some weekend pickups. Or maybe you saw my shorts from over the weekend talking about how I saw uh, Unmatched Series, what is it, 8 in stores? So I did get this uh, kind of Ring of Honor era CM Punk, the last CM Punk figure that uh, AEW Jazzwares will ever make, and I'm kind of going back and forth on it. It's not a figure that I was like dying to have in my collection. I already have my fill of CM Punks, and we'll actually get to that later today with this package right here. So this one I'm going to keep in the box. I'm hoping to uh, find the chase somewhere. If I do find the chase, I'll end up opening this one up and I'll have a review on the channel. But for now, this one will stay here. I do think this will be worth something one day. It is a very unique CM CM Punk and AEW should maybe own his kind of like Ring of Honor image. So there you go. I don't know if, what I'm trying to say there is I don't know if we'll get another figure like that, but this is kind of the hallmark of this episode. This is a CM Punk figure that I have wanted more than anything. It is an elite. Uh, it's not one that you would probably expect, but I was watching my damn toys uh, video, I want to say maybe a couple months back, and he ranked every CM Punk action figure. And this one I saw in that video, never knew it existed because I've only gotten in the wrestling collection over the past couple of years, and I had to have it. And it always been kind of out of my price range, you know, like 40, 50, 60 bucks. But I found a bid on eBay, and I actually ended up winning it for uh, only 30 so I'm not complaining. It is quite old. It's from Elite 29, uh, but yeah, so this is the CM Punk figure that I actually got, and it's in pretty damn good condition. So yeah, it is the Elite 29 CM Punk. The reason that I like it is, well, number one, I love the sideburns there. I love the kind of that Abe Lincoln look that he had going. I think it looks sweet. This is what I believe to be the only Elite that kind of encompassed that look of his, but that's my favorite Punk look as well. He has the mutton chops, the sideburns, whatever you want to call it. Love that. I was very surprised. It, the, uh, the, the torso is a little loose and the legs are just a tad bit loose. But for the most part, it is a pretty well you know handled and uh, not loose figure, I guess I could say. He's got some interesting gear on too. Of course, not the Chicago colors. That is an elite, I'm sure, like a grail for everybody. Kind of that pipe bomb promo punk. Uh, with the No, actually, he was wearing the... Well, never mind. You guys know what I'm saying there. But this gear is pretty cool. I love the stars there. He's got the, uh, the, the kick pads and the knee pads all on there. Looks great with the tattoos. And I love the red X on there. A lot of punks we get have the black X. I love the red X on there. It looks sweet. And more importantly, something that I was really like hoping to get with this figure was the sweatshirt that it came with. This is a very, very unique CM Punk sweatshirt. It's kind of this like metallic navy blue. It's got the punk logo on the front there, as well as on the back with the kind of Chicago and stars. And I'm just so happy to have this figure. I'm not really going to waste any time, you know, putting the sweater on, but they are both in perfect condition condition. Aside from the looseness, you guys can see there is absolutely no paint missing. On a lot of the ones you might find on eBay or online, there's a lot of uh, paint missing from the hair and stuff like that. It is perfect. And uh, yeah, no complaints from me. Very glad to have had this figure. So yeah, quick recap. We got the Elite 29 CM Punk uh, along with his sweatshirt. So the complete figure, I guess I can say. And then we also got the AEW, uh, what is it? Unmatched Series 8 Luminaries Ring of Honor era CM Punk. So yeah, some punk pickups as I'm going to coin it uh, from the past weekend. So there you go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. We're kind of closing in on 300 subscribers, and it'd be kind of cool to get there maybe by the, uh, the end of the month of April. That'd be pretty sweet. But yep. Yeah. so folks, that is all I have in this video. If you guys like what's going on here, be sure to subscribe. I got reviews coming at least every week, uh, and along with some shorts and stuff like that. I'll leave it there, folks. As always, my name is Navigator. Have a nice day. Take care.